things about it when I saw it and, and got to experience it and, and realized that it was really true. Sugar Creek Charter School is making a big difference, not just in the kids' lives, but in our community. And I really wanted my kids to be here. Our philosophy is every child will learn. Not every child can learn. We know they all can. Every child will. And when you do that, that puts the responsibility on us and not on the children. to see to it that they learn. And in order to make that happen, we made the decision we needed to do whatever it took and we needed to build a school that met the needs of the children who were here. I had a daughter, for example, who came here who was having some challenges socializing and things like that. We were concerned about her when she came in the seventh grade. The school impact on her was incredible. Um, she's now um, in the tenth grade. She's a straight A student, has a 4.6 GPA. Uh, but more than that, she really loves going to school. If you buy into, you know, the kids come from families, they don't have support, they don't, et cetera, et cetera, you know the whole deal. Well, then those things are all outside of us, and they're things we cannot control. If, however, we say that every child will learn given effective instruction, and they don't learn, then that means the, the instruction wasn't effective. Our teachers, their point of view is, the students didn't get it, what do I need to do differently? And I keep, need to keep doing it differently until they get it that we have control over. We're the professionals. This is what we can do. We acknowledge that there are challenges in education, but we don't complain about them much. They're all willing to do what it takes. That's our common strength. That's our common thread. I know that there is some perception that um, charter schools are elitist in some way, that, that they tend to pull um, wealthier suburban populations. Um, but, and there are some schools like that, That's, I mean it's true, there are some schools like that. However, there are also a lot of schools that are targeting students who need a lot. And that that's the focus, providing an opportunity for students who need a lot. And that's been our focus all from the very beginning and we wouldn't want to do anything else. And one of the ways I see Sugar Creek changing this community um, is by its presence. The transportation piece here is incredible. Uh, the fact that they offer transportation to all of their students. And so when you see, when you're in and around the community, you see Sugar Creek Charter School buses all over the community. Um, and, and, and you see them going into really um, bad neighborhoods, you see them going into good neighborhoods, you see their buses everywhere. Many of the new charter schools that open and other charter schools that exist have already exempted our kids because they don't provide transportation. Not only did they like help me academically, but it made me a better person. It made me look at everything differently, especially when you have teachers that actually care about you, who actually want to see you do well. There are other schools in this city who, because of what they're hearing in Sugar Creek Charter, are changing how they're doing things. Um, and so it's creating this sense of, uh, of I don't know what to call it competition, but at least it sure is accountability. So the most exciting part of my day is to the ability to walk around the school and see students that other folks have given up on, to see those students actively engage in the learning process, and that you really can see and debunk the myth that students from generation poverty can't learn. Because we have a thousand students here that they, I can show you that they can learn. I think that we can impact our community by sending kids out who are learning that education is important, learning to value it, that being smart is okay, that you have a future and that there is a world that's waiting for you. You can add something to it.